what are all making my curls? Everybody's asking me all the time what I've been doing myself the last few months. Well, not much because I've been trying busy trying to get my house and sorted out, spend time with my kids and all the rest of it. But I thought to the night and do a little repair. I'm too special. This is a garage find, it's an Eprom razor. Eprom razor does exactly what it says in the terminal. It's a uh, it plants off any program chip with a window on the top of it so you can reprogram them. But physically, it's just a box with a fluorescent tube and start on a timer on it. So, it's a really easy fix. And you can see, I've got a standard bulb in it and it fires up a treat. Okay. That's a safety feature on it. Let's show it there. It's got a switch on the door. Now, why does it have that? Because here's a chip that's broken in it. That's a clear fluorescent chip, it's a special type. And it's very, very, very short wave radiation. It wouldn't be very good for your eyes, your hands, skin in general. Those, these things are designed to kill bacteria cells, so they're probably going to kill any other cell that com come in contact with them. It's like getting sunburn from hell. But anyway, switch action is working fine. Timer is working fine. What not much else to do at all to it. All I need to do now is fit. I can't get it out of the box. Fit the correct EV tube, which is this one. Hmm, that one would appear to be. Oh, yeah. You might find that weird, but see that? I don't know if you can see it, but see that little tiny dot in there? That's the mercury. That's what gives the tube its distinct glow. It's interesting, you can see that for closure. But anyway, this, this is working fine, so I'll just give you a look at the top. All that was wrong with it was the tube was smashed. Nothing at all else. I'll be using this to initially to blank off gold fever's existing ROMs because they're dead, they're corrupt. And using the program I've got up the stairs, most of the chips look okay. I think it's just one that's kind of gone. But I don't think it's a chip itself, I think it's just been lying too long or something or been exposed to too much direct sunlight because the little sticker was missing off the window but I didn't see. I'm not going to leave it on long enough to show the time on but I just need to replace this with that proper bulb that goes in there and then I'll be able to use it. Alright so, bye for now.